Hey guys, what's up? We're playing more Final Fantasy XIV. Uh, why? I don't know. <laughs> Good question. Anyway, I've been playing this a little bit off screen. It's not bad. I'm kind of feeling it actually. Except for the whole pink eye patch and matching pink gloves deal. <laughs> Seriously, okay, okay. You, you give a man an eye patch and you're like, oh, sweet. There's nothing more badass than an eye patch, fucking. Uh, Snake, Metal Gear Solid has one. Freaking Samuel Jackson from uh, the Avengers has one. Captain Cook has one. All things badass. And then you take something as badass and you make it pink. Congratulations, Final Fantasy XIV. You made the most badass thing, Femi. Like that guy. Fucking short shorts. Anyway, uh, l let me tell you my thoughts as soon as we talk to this asshole. I think we're done with the dumb quest. I think I say that, but you never really know with this shit. Should I be son of Vetra? Might be drop the body to deliver something special that you like. Oh, this isn't interesting at all. This is straight up stupid. I'm just delivering stuff. Oh, the goddamn smell. Oh, shit. Oh, tell me, tell me I just got a pink blouse for completing that mission. I have a feeling, I have a feeling it's gonna be pink. It is! <laughs> of course, of course. You can't, you can't just make a manly ass fucking axe wielding god of destruction worshipping badass in this game. No, no. He has to be all prettied up in pink. Son of a fucking bitch. God damn it. <laughs> I'm sure there's a way to, like, die your shit so it, it doesn't suck ass. But for the, I don't know. I don't know a lot of shit about this game. I don't know much. What I do know is that uh, I got up to level 5 off screen because all the quests before that were absolutely dumb. They were not even worth recording. And hopefully, hopefully, we'll get some missions that are worth watching. Uh, I, I'm i going to join this guild. It's like a class guild or something. I think there's interesting shit going on here. Oh, look, we got the whole Yellow Jacket Boys crew. Just tossing the sharks. Oh, is that our is that our gang? Are we the sharks? We're fighting the Jets? We're the Yellow Jacket Boys, a.k.a. the sharks? God, you guys suck. Sup, Wernzwin? Let's go on you, man. You look kind of badass. Yes, I'm Wernzwin. X-Master, they call me. Not the most imaginative of titles. I agree, but one should not underestimate the value of directness. I welcome your interest in our guild. I am the Bat. That's neat. The art of the Marauder is used to rend, to cleave, and to destroy. It is not our way to simply outfight our adversaries. We seek to overwhelm them. I can overwhelm them with, um, um, my pinkness. <laughs> I mean, I, I can tell you're pretty overwhelmed right now. Yeah? See how, see how manly I am while wearing pink? It's pretty overwhelming, isn't it? No, it's not. It is not. A marauder must be the most powerful and enduring presence on the battlefield. We must account for the most enemies for the most enemies defeated. Our role in combat is that of a steel whirlwind, dealing death and destruction without equal. Okay, I think I picked the right class. This is right up my alley, I'm feeling this. No doubt the question has already been put to you by but oh, uh, but once more, can I challenge your commitment? Are you prepared for the bloody carnage that awaits an initiate of the Marauders Guild? Hell's fucking yeah, bitch! I'ma fuck shit up! Well, shit as in any shit that's below the waist. Because <laughs> that's as far as I can reach. Very well, your name? Attend me well then, Grim. Hold fast to this moment of dedication. The path of the Marauder is a jagged and perilous one. The blood that spills at your feet will oft times be your own. You stand now as a student of the axe. Let us waste no time in testing the edge of your chosen weapon. You shall wade straightway 
into combat as befits a novice of our discipline. Go forth and slay the bleeding, scurrying, crawling pest that plague the outskirts of Limsa Limsa. Lost lambs, wolf rats, little ladybugs shall be your piteous adversaries this day. Return to me once the have each creature have fallen to your blade. Now, okay, it sounded like super badass and shit, buddy. I won't lie. Up until the part where he told me to kill ladybugs and sheep and war rats. <laughs> okay, you know, whatever. Let's, let's kill some let's kill some innocent creatures. Innocent creatures! Prepare to be beaten up by a little dwarf in pink clothing. It's gonna hurt! It's gonna hurt real bad! Why my key bindings not working? Son of a bitch. Oh, hold on. I'm going to lay waste to this ladybug. Can I teabag it? Uh, I can't crouch. Uh, uh, just, okay. You know what? You know what? I, I, this guy is so small, he has to jump to teabag things. <laughs> Let me mess with my key bindings, because for some reason, they're not working. Why? Oh my god. Jesus. Okay. Oh, that took forever. Oh my god. I thought my character was looking femmy. <laughs> oh my god. Destroy the ladybug! Kill it! With, with much feather! It was talking much shit about your mother. It said something not very nice about your apparel too. Kill the wolf rat. <laughs> you know, can we just can we just lay? How many do we have to kill each? Oh, three. Let's kill this ladybug too, because why not, huh? Um, now combat, as you can see, isn't exactly too exciting at first. You know what I'm saying? Quite literally, we're pressing two buttons. I have a third. It's a cooldown. Is when shit hits the fan, you know. So uh, I need to save that for when I fight three ladybugs at once. <laughs> anyway, wow, this is exciting. Uh, let's fucking skip this shit and get back to plot. Wait, who the fuck is that? A mossless goo boo. Oh, I like this guy. Hey, hi, hey, hi. Hey. Hi. That's why I imagine him saying, and, and, and my little mutant fella just responds with, <coughs> Oh, I scared him! I'm sorry, buddy! Dead ass, though. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, we're. Oh, oh, fuck, I have to slay lost lambs now. Oh, shit, I have to go to another place to find them, I think. I don't know if there's any, um, innocent little lambs to slaughter around here, so, uh, let me find some. La la la! La la! Chastity night, really? You fucking suck, dude. <laughs> fucking white knight of chastity. Send a swiftwing, seriously! People's names suck in this game. I think these are like, uh. Uh. What, what's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> I think they're like real players that like. Take their gaming seriously. They're like, I'm gonna RP as a guy named Chastity Knight. Gah. It's like, really? Like, they, they get immersed in the game. Not me. I'm a little pink fucking mutant with an axe that worships the god of destruction. Go forth, lost lamb. Go forth to doom. I'll send you to oblivion myself. <laughs> oh my god. This last lamb is huge! Oh, it did a fleece butt. Oh. Oh, that's appropriate because its butt is quite literally made of fleece. Okay. I'm gonna challenge both of you at once! Suck it, lost lambs! Nobody likes you! You spread anthrax! That's true. You can get anthrax from a uh, sheep. Bet you didn't know that. Yeah. Hey, what are you doing? Where'd you get that chocobo? I want a chocobo. Give me your chocobo. Fork it over, nerd. I'll destroy you. Yeah, whatever. Chocobo, stupid. Okay, we did it. We killed innocent creatures. In the name of the god of destruction. Hooray! Let's go. Uh, let's go tell uh, Batman all the good news. Oh, hey, let's crack a bitch. I'm in mean, battering. Keyword bad. Oh, yeah. You can give me some kicks. Still, I'm sorry, Grim. Ah, fancy a trip outside the city walls. I did. I murdered creatures. It was fun. 
I'd like to visit the orchard names of the super severe if you ever the place of evidence. Go to this place, I'm gonna talk with way more words than I need to. Yeah, cause that's what you do, man. All you had to say was like, go here, and I was like, okay. <laughs> no, you had to give me the whole fucking backstory behind it. Jesus Christ, buddy. Fuck. Fuck off, Gri- Are you Griffith? Oh, Griffin! If you were Griffith, I would be super pissed at you. By the way, uh, something I noticed, I want to point this out, friends, is, uh, it seems that this game is filled with fucking cat people. Kaji have taken this game over. That is, like, every character, damn near every character in this game is a fucking cat person, I swear. How many mutant little midgets are there? Like, me, and one other guy that's AFK. <laughs> You are returned to me a different man. Already your face shows a harder cast. A realization of the slaughter of which you are capable. But there is much training to be done before you wield the axe to its fullest potential. Learn well your lessons, build your strength, and make of each swing an instinctive act. You shall have this hunting log to aid you in that endeavor. Its pages are marked with opponents suitable for honing your skills. Oh, I thought you were giving me, like, an actual log. Like, a block of wood. It's like, why are you giving me a block of wood? You want me to chop it with my axe? Because, you know, it's normally what axes are used for. I'm just saying. There are, of course, myriad of methods by which you might improve your techniques. But when the way forward is not readily apparent, the log provides a reliable source of challenges. Once again, all I can think of is just chopping logs, buddy. Every blow of your weapon will clear another step towards the master of the Marauder way. Implacable, relentless. Such must be your momentum on both the practice grounds and the battlefield. And that! Wait, I am level 5. Yeah, I'm level 5, bitch. Give me that quest. Work it over, badge. So what's this? A hunting log is a record of your completion task. Only slaying certain creatures. By completing these tasks, you will earn rewards and unlocking new challenges. The log can be accessed via logs on the main menu. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Oh, look. <laughs> Is the ladybug our target? I can kill them. I've proven it. Anyway. Axe Master Winzoen wishes you to experience a traditional marauder training method. You don't say. Ooh, ooh, maybe you'll give me something that isn't pink. Oh, that looks pink, actually. Oh, we get a new axe. Oh, shit the fuck. Yes, I want a new axe. What do you got for me? Grim, you approach me with a marauder's strides. Determined, unswerving, and bereft of the hesitation that marked our first meeting. Didn't we just meet, like... Five minutes ago, <laughs> whatever. I am pleased. The time has come for you to begin a new stage in your training. Now, what sets the axe aside from the gladius or the dagger? It is the raw, unstoppable destruction wrought by its thick, heavy blade. And that overwhelming power can only be properly directed by extraordinarily physical strength. Thus, we have come to the core of this day's lesson. Such strength as a marauder must possess is developed through the traditional method passed down through the generations of the guild. A method that you, too, shall be taught to employ. Present yourself to Broodbar in the practice area downstairs, and he shall instruct you further. Dude, you are like a fucking warrior poet, man. I'm feeling it. Seriously, okay, we need to find this bitch. Hey, Brown Bar! The warrior poet upstairs said I should kick ass in the most eloquent name. What are these bitches doing? There's guns in this game? Why don't we just shoot people? Why are we going around with axes? We could be shooting people. Look at these broads. They all got guns. I want a gun. What the fuck? The axe master told me he'd be on your way. Me name's Brown Bar. Good it is to be a new marauder! Now, we axe wielders build strength and control by split boulders! That's right, our traditional method involves smashing a rock with the axe! Well, that's cool. But she can't just use any old swing! You need to hit the rock just so! Rock game ain't full of marauder is waiting! 
just outside the fifth for gate. But the bridge over the road, Grandma. She'll teach you how it's done. We gonna smash some rocks. Still, kind of want a gun. Don't want one of your jackets, because they suck. Seriously, what's going on over here? Oh, is this like the squats from Final Fantasy VII? Is that a emote? Can I squat? Can I pop a squat? Ah, wait, what are my emotes? Hold on. Oh, time out. Time out. What are my emotes? I'm going to, uh... Furious? <laughs> what is furious? Uh, I don't see any squat. Fume? Cry? No. Pray? No praying. Wait, we pray to the god of destruction. Okay, let's just, just do furious. <laughs> Panic. <laughs> I love it. Okay, get psyched. Oh, that's my favorite one so far. Hold on, hold on. We need to see that, like, close up. Do it. <laughs> okay. Let's, uh, let's go smash some rocks. Let's go smash some rocks. Yeah! We got a sprint button, too. I don't know if I went over that. We can sprint. Supposedly, we can get chocobos. I don't know how yet. If you know how, I would love to know. Because I want to be riding on a chocobo. Preferably a pink one to match my blouse. <laughs> Where the fuck are these rocks at? What the heck is that? Oh, Saki! Are you okay? I gotta live my help! Oh, oh, Saki Pink. Whoa, holy shit! Saki's like a fucking ninja! Oh my god! She's like roundhouse kicks! Oh, oh, let's give her some room. Jeez, oh my god. Wow, holy fuck! Don't fuck with her. She can kick. I can't do that. Well, I could, but it would only reach your toesies. Because I'm so small. Alright, where are. The rocks! They need to be smashed! This is not the place! I'm gonna jump on the bed, though. Yeah! 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 Oh, I'm sorry. You popped in out of nothingness, cat lady. Well, this is awkward. So, uh... How are things? Do you use a litter box? <laughs> Did you throw up on my couch earlier? I think you did. I have so many questions for cat people. I don't think I'm gonna get any answers either. Sup, Chad? I'm the super manly munchkin in the pink blouse. Here to crush some rocks and stuff. What you gotta say to that, man? Uh, oh, you must be the adventure battery, I promise it's that long. Good boots, wasn't it? You honored his word, so that's a good start. I'm still word, the old bastard. As better than likely to describe me, uh, this here is my humble orchard. A good number of lads and lads work here once terrorize the high seas. And if you wonder why I employ these scrags, well, they used to be crew of my pirate ship. S what's a scrag? Should I be offended by that? Oh look, there's a crack rock. I need to click the crack rock. But the calamity did for our ship, like it did so many others, and I was sore wounded into the bargain. I had to feed myself up a crew somehow, and I will win the initiative to get the landlocked buccaneers work in the field seem too fine off to refuse. Hey, you ever uh, hear the words of the Ironborn, we do not sow? That is exactly what you're doing. Literally. You are sowing. You have an orchard. What the fuck? You were the worst pirate ever. <laughs> well, it turns out you can take the pirate away from the sea, but you can't take the sea away from the pirate. <laughs> Am I right, buddy? Oh my god, let's go! <laughs> a lot of my books just never took the dead of the soil, see? Yeah, I don't blame him! He's a fucking ironborn. That's how it works. Alright? And unfortunately, the botanist I called to train them and have been ring of our house and blocked the spur. With so much work piled up, I need a tougher soul like you to step in and help where it's needed. Okay. Oh, you're gonna give me some kicks? Yeah! We don't want these fucking Birkenstocks? Oh, that gives intelligence. Okay. We need the leather crackles! The leather Birkenstocks. Because we don't look like lesbian enough. <laughs> we did. Oh my god! I love! Oh my god! 
What? What I learn? Fracture delivers an attack with a potency of 100. Additional effect damage over time. Ooh, neat. A dot. Well, that's what they call it in the MMO game. <laughs> um, okay. Let me equip up my new shoes and mess with my shit. Please tell me they're pink. <laughs> oh, oh lord, I need pink shoes. Are they pink? I can't really see them. I think they might be pink. Are those clogs? I think they're, I think they're wooden clogs. Oh, they are pink. Yes, of course. Couldn't have a, uh, you know, manly colored things. For the munchkin. You fucking son of a bitch. Okay, keybinds updated. Pink shoes equipped. Let's look at this bitch. Stillworm, owner of the Somerset Farms, wishes to inspect your equipment and thereby gauge your readiness for the tasks he has in mind. I have a mind to set you on a task, Booth. But before I do, I need to make sure you're properly kitted out. Pirates don't care for par to parlay with dandies, you understand? <laughs> really? I think we're both dressed in very feminine colors. I think people may mistake us for a couple of dandies. <laughs> I'm just saying. It might well be that the ones here have traded in their cutlasses for cultures, but they're still rogues at heart. I know a solid set of girls. I see you. Come back when you think you're most suitably equipped. Am I not good enough? Oh, oh. I need to hit up the dude that sells the shit. Uh... I think he's down here. See me stick that landing? Yeah. Hold at your boy. You got anything in pink? That's all I want to know. Equip new pants. Aw, oh, they're not pink. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> anyway, I, th I think we're good. I think we're looking pretty solid here, friends. We are ready to do whatever stupid fucking task this dandy has for us. Oh, I got to click the... Heisenberg Blue real quick. Also, uh, they have free companies in this game, and I just got an invite from a man named Smokin' Toke. I'm tempted to take him up on this offer. Although, I think I'm supposed to be in a... Uh, I, I haven't joined one yet, but I think I'm supposed to be in a specific one with someone else, so... Uh, We'll, uh, we'll deal with that later. Let's have a look at you, shall we? Oh, -ho! as long as you're this well covered, I won't feel any guilt thrown you to the sharks. <laughs> Your spell book and yours are an ordinary lot. They rage in love for the sea and care little for the laws of the land. But they respect strength. And by the looks of you, I'd say you have little trouble getting their attention. Really? You see this and you think, oh, this guy's, this guy's tough. <laughs> you have a good eye there, friend. It's, it's the one covered by the eye patch. Boom! <laughs> oh, fuck, I just bought one of these. God damn it. Leather grimoire. Uh, I guess I'll just take the, the money dollars. Okay! I thought we were gonna smash rocks, buddy! Ah, boo! That aura of confidence tells me you've not been idle since the last we met. I just met you like five seconds ago. I hope you've read you right. Uh, for I have a task that requires the attention of a capable venturer. Might that venture be you? I don't know. What do you want? Lurkers in the grotto? Who is lurking in my grotto? Are you going to inform me, buddy? I think you are. Good to hear that I shall lay before you the sorry tale. You will have heard rumors of the abductions. Aye, citizens have been disappearing from every corner of Limsa as if plucked from the face of Heidelin, boots and all by an unseen hand. And what's this got to do with the summer fruit farm? You might ask. Well, that remains to be seen. But it seems a collection of right unsavory fellows with azure tattooed faces have been creeping up to the edges of the fields and spying on me women! Are Yemen? Y Yaomen? I'm gonna assume that's women. Are there any women here? You're really defensive of women, man? Are you? I have a feeling you're not. <laughs> Judging this purely on the color of your blouse. <laughs> no, I doubt anyone would enjoy being scrutinized by such savages at the best time. But the farm heads are convinced that they're the kidnappers of rumor. Come for their hides! Gasp! 
needless to say, they're beside themselves with worry. Their work suffered for it, which is the very last thing I need when my old crewmen are getting used to their new jobs, to the struggle to get them to leave the farmhouse of the morning. That is, as they say, where you come in. Would you be willing to investigate these tattoo thugs for me? Okay, but I thought I was going to split rocks. Are we going to do that anytime soon? Because I got my hopes up. Junk. Okay, fine. Whatever. Good lad. The sooner we get to the bottom of this, the sooner this place will start to resemble a working farm again. I suggest you begin uh, having a look around the seesaw grotto. If reports are to be believed, our unwelcome visitors have occupied this place. Be careful, though, Boost. I can't say for sure what manner of miscreants we're dealing with here. If they are kidnappers, well, just be on your guard, okay? Okay, guy. Okay. By the way, I'm super jelly of your pink eye patch, but it's just a shitty shade of brown. Yeah, that's great. Whatever. On some quests, you will encounter objects! Which you- yeah, I, yeah, okay, thanks.